My name is Cadet Havens. My name is Cadet Ricky. Edge of some sort. Uh, grab, grab the top part of the sheet, roughly 12 inches back from the front, from the head of the bed. Uh, pull it up to uh, as close to a 45 degree angle as possible. Tuck the underneath portion of the sheet under the mattress, and then using your hand as a guide, flip the top portion back over. and under the mattress. On the second sheet, you're going to make it parallel with the head of the bed and six inches away from the edge. At that point, it's going to get pulled and tucked underneath of the foot of the bed. We want the top of this blanket to be exactly flush with the top sheet. Possible corners. Take your pillow, you want it at the head of the bed, centered left and right, and flush to the edge of the mattress. Also, you want the loose this tucked underneath of the pillow and away from the inspection side. You will slide it underneath of the second sheet and first blanket. At this step, you're going to make the dust cover, which is with the second blanket. You're going to fold it lengthwise in half so you take the creased side that's going to face the foot of the bed it's going to be 24 inches in length from the head of the bed to the edge of the dust cover Once you finish making the bed, you're going to ground the mattress to the head of the frame and center it left and right on the frame. The white collar bed, you're going to follow the same steps as the dust cover bed up until the point where you would put on the pillow. And you're going to fold the blanket twice in such a manner that you're going to have 18 inches of white space here with a 6 inch band that's folded under. Have the loose open end folded underneath of the pillow and away from the inspection side, centered left and right with, on the mattress, flush to the head of the mattress. And now with the dust cover that we removed from the earlier bed, um, we will now fold the dust cover into an e-fold. Again, we want to make sure that the U.S. insignia is on the inside, and we're going to fold it to the center. and then make sure that the edges are as flush as possible and we're going to fold it towards each other with the smoother side on the inspection side and next we're going to fold it into the shape of a lowercase e by folding it in thirds from the left with eliminating all the creases. Just pulling it one more time. Wait, wait, pause. I don't even have it on. Ready? This one's called white collar. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Three, two.